I'm Whatever. alive. You were clinically dead for 22 seconds. Oh, well, that's not too bad. At least it's not minutes. Then how did I make it out? Hey, you're still with us. Guys, get to Sam Node. Riders awake. Who are you talking to? Sam. I didn't hear him. See? You're Sam's right. in my head now. Look here. And here. My father. What? Where? Yeah, uh, he's dead. I knew it! It was your life or his. And he chose you. Very clearly. I'm sorry, Scott. I know this must be a blow. <laughs> I thought she was going to say, I know this must blow. Uh, I don't know why it keeps coming up with the, all these options of I didn't know him or... He got the team out of danger. We all owe him for that. He once said that when his time came, he wanted to go out among stars no one had seen before. Did she have a thing for my dad? Is that what was going on here? What are we doing in Sam, Node? Sam is now part of you. See, I in knew it. In a way we don't entirely understand. It played havoc with your brain. Sam? Your father authorized the transfer of Pathfinder to authority to you. Ah, uh, that's she what he transferred. Court. In theory. In reality, you're the new Pathfinder, Scott. Okay, this makes... Whoa. This oh. makes sense now. If that's how it has to be, don't sell yourself short. I think you can do it. Cora? It's what he wanted. I won't stand in the way. But being Pathfinder is a serious job. Yeah. You sure you're ready for this? I can I'm learn. Sure there's a lot I don't know, but I'll figure it out. If it helps, you've got me to lean on. It's all academic anyway. Sam's linked to your mind on a deeper level now. Trying to untangle it could kill you. I know this is tough, but... So is that what my dad did? He tangled Sam with me? Or was that what they had to do to keep me alive? Is still drifting? That's the thing. Whatever your dad did with that tower, it saved the day. Some sort of atmosphere scrubber. The energy cloud thinned out. We're on our way to the rally point now. Should be at the Nexus soon. He needs to rest first. He's got nah. two hours. We'll need our Pathfinder for this. So wait, are we landing on Earth, or...? I think we're landing on Earth. Or not... Earth 2. Oh, Earth 2.0. There's still no change. But if you can pull through, so can she. I thought she was fine. I thought that was the whole thing. Your father will be missed. What's going on, Sam? This is our private channel. I shared it with him. Why did, Why did he pick you? Why me? Unknown. But he never acted without reason. Alec wouldn't want us to lose sight of the goal. He said pain emboldens our resolve. He'd insist we grow stronger from his passing. Okay. So that's that's a little bit of a twist. Um, yeah. It's a little bit of a twist. Who the hell is this? The head honcho bad guy? What the hell is that? Ah, here we go.
The question is, is do I get the N7 armor? I better get the N7 armor. And then they're going to be hunting me if I'm wearing the N7 armor. Is he copying me? It's because he doesn't have Sam. Okay, odd. So I guess Rider, this is our ship now, or feet. my ship now. We're at the Nexus. It's the forward hub for the entire Andromeda initiative. The okay. Asari, Solarian, and Turian arcs should be there too. Okay, so we do still get the other races. Let's hope they've had better luck. Starting our approach now. It's almost as big as the Citadel back home. Next I'm pretty sure that's what the, the point is. <laughs> Captain, I'm only getting their automated approach channel. Not a live person. Well, like it or not, we're here. Take us in. Are they not even going to be here? It's an interesting concept. It should have been finished by now. Could be worse. How? Habitat 7's a bust. We might have started a war with the first aliens we met, and our Pathfinder's dead. This better be rock bottom. Green across the board. Docking initiated. Because the first three Mass Effect games were trying to save humanity. This All is right. trying to reestablish humanity, so... It's interesting. Good luck, Pathfinder. Oh, now I gotta do all the work. Is this how... Is this what's going on? Oh, wow. Okay. I'm in the atrium. Uh... The captain just called me Pathfinder. This is really happening. Just take a deep breath. I don't know where I'm going, but... Oh, it's a lander. Okay. It'll be nice to see some oh. friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew. Just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. <laughs> You're this is literally the exact same thing as the Nothing Citadel. We've been through. I could use a buzz. We all could. But I, I have a feeling uh, this welcome isn't going to be so happy. Real food and a shower are just ahead. I mean, I don't know that for sure, but I'm, I'm guessing. With the whole construction thing not being complete. Uh, I don't see yeah. Champagne. Where is everybody? Uh Well this can't be right. It's like everything's on standby. If it's a surprise party, they're doing a whole fleet good job of it. Here's a construction worker. Hi there. We're from Arc Hyperion and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an arc? Yeah, we just got in. But we thought you were all dead. What? What? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... But you're here. You have no idea how much this means. I don't believe it. I'm Jiren Kandros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. I'm Scott Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Well, I've got a shipload of people that says we're here. 
Of course, it's just... You're the first Ark we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Huh. Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. So none of the other Arcs that were supposed to get here have got here. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar. That's what happened to us. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were punished. Oh. Exiles, we call them. Are things back to normal? So there's a group of close. bad guys. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone. We're here. You guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Okay. They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one was expecting an arc to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. All right, now we're seeing some other races. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. I'm Jaron Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Food, water, we're short on everything. Wait, you don't have food? You're supposed to have food! Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. Alec is dead. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust. And oh, been none of them did? Arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. So we need food. We need to find more resources. But that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A golden world. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now falls to you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? I am. I may not have been the first choice, but I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. This chick's a bitch. That's no way to treat a guest. Who's this guy? I'm not more cash. Superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. Alright. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm having Scout to work chip? The details with your associate. She's my associate. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you for standing up for me there. Mm, hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance. Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. Okay. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. My ship has and that power much power? Out, you'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. Okay. Okay, so we got a bunch. There's a side mission up there. I mean, we might as well go grab this side mission. Down here. Oh, there's a lot of side missions. Okay. Well, we'll just hit them as we go by. 
Uh, the one thing with Mass Effect is, is you want, want to do the side seven. missions. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we've found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. I thought it didn't measure up as Pathfinder. Director Addison keeps her own counsel. I keep mine. And when you disagree? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. Okay. And the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here. Eos. How? Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then yeah, how do we do that? Colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. What? Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Just point me to my ship and I'll be out of here. They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when okay. you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. That's a headache. Something wrong? Ryder, King Simi and Sam live on the Hyperion. Your import needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. That's a really cool thing. Okay. Uh, we might as well get... Ryder. You have my condolences for your father. I appreciate the side it. mission here. I didn't know him very well, although I understand he played a key role in planning the initiative. I'm sure he'd be concerned that we still have several arcs missing. I'll find them. They're as much a part of the initiative as the human arc. We'll find them. We have to. Tens of thousands of colonists are unaccounted for. It paints the initiative in an unflattering light. Did you have some other business? Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No, and that is the distressing part. The Asari, Turian, and Salarian arcs are completely unaccounted for. If they had the same problems with the Scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Should you okay. find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. Are there any other arcs we should expect? We had hoped Quarians would be part of the first wave, but before departure in 2185, we got word they had technical problems with their ship. It seems they're also bringing along Drell, Hanar, and other species as well. In the Managing same arc? Their biological needs cause complications. We oh, no, same arc. Some time to come. Okay. I don't think That's I need all. anything else. Thanks for your time. I'm happy to help. You will find our futures depend on each other's success. Good luck. Okay. So it's telling me to go this way. Oh, what do we have here? Hello, Information wall. I'm Jan Garson, founder of the initiative. It's through your hard work that the vision of the Nexus has come to life. You and all your colleagues bind our proud new colonies together. Look around at your achievements. And if you have any questions, my door is always open. Founder oh, you're one of those people, are you? At workspace not allocated. Please select <laughs> a topic. Uh... For initiative strategy and pathfinder coordination, please see director Jaron Tan. For colonial affairs or outpost status, please see Director Foster Addison. For station maintenance, please contact Superintendent Mac Morkesh. For militia operations or Apex deployment, please see Tiran Kandros. 
Okay. My employee data. Scott Ryder, salary code 19B, active Pathfinder. Your supervisor is Director Tad. Based on current staffing needs, you will be eligible for paid vacation time in 187 <laughs> days. Paid vacation. Why not plan on which beautiful colony you'll vacation on while you wait? Okay, I don't, I don't really know what I'm supposed to be getting from there. So, I guess I go back to the Hyperion? What do we have in here? Just wrong. Just wrong. It's not right. It's not fair. What's Pro not? Oh my. You're... So it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're in What do you need? This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband, he's locked up and slated for exile for a crime he didn't commit. What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda, but the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are so I gotta investigate this? Evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Milken Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. Okay, so there's a little side mission for us. Uh, do I go this way? I think I go this way. Alright, so we gotta go back to the Hyperion and talk to Sam. Whoops! That's not where I meant to go. Not even a little bit. I accidentally sent myself to the Cryo Bay. So, so far, um, as far as this game goes, I'm really enjoying it. Um, I kind of, the one... Okay, well, first, first things first, we're in the wrong place. Not operations... Habitation deck? Is that where I want to go? Um, what was I saying? Oh, the one problem that people are saying is the animations aren't as good. I haven't seen anything too ridiculous yet. Um, I don't really know what else to say other than that. It's so far, I guess it seems fine to me. Alright, so we gotta go talk to Sam. Sam's gonna drop some information on us here. Trium. Here we go. What do you have to say, Sam? Hello, Scott. Welcome back to Sam Mode. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. This is the captain. Sam, if we're going to work together, you can't keep hiding things from me. Apologies. I am simply following your father's wishes. What was he keeping all, secret? All like of these were his wishes? Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. So he can control me. Now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique tactical augmentation during combat. That's cool. Would rather prefer to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. A computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. So we kind of saw this in the first Mass Effect. Though I'm artificial in design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. Okay. Well, just so long as it doesn't hurt. The only pain is that which life provides. As I've discovered, this can be a lesson in itself. It's one I'd rather avoid. So It's really depressing. I find myself in an unusual position. 
Though I had access to your father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. How so? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. So he's trying to hide things that happened in his life. But not without recourse. The further you explore as a Pathfinder, the more blocks will be removed. Ah. In your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship will... This is actually a really cool concept. Thanks. Oh, so here we go. So here's where we get to choose our, um... Different profiles. How do I unlock these? I have to have skill points. So I do have skill points to level up, but I'm going to leave them for now just because I don't know quite what's good yet. Uh, find a way to remove Sam's memory blocks. Okay. So we got to go to my father's. Uh, this is a really cool concept because anything in a video game that can um, lead you to have questions about the game is always good. Uh, so we want to go to the docking bay. Apparently. Um, is always, generally speaking, a good thing. Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. So what, we're about to get a sweet ship? Is that what is that what's going on here? 